Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dolvek today for a really, really quick new world video about one of the most underrated ability in a game. So you will see most of the time your healer gonna run build similar to this. Maybe they're gonna change some passes, but this is one of the most common builds and it works and it's good, okay? But if your teammate have enough CCs, if they have enough crowd, crowd control, it makes the petrifying stream almost useless. And guess what? The essence control is just way better than the petrifying stream when you think about it. Just look at this, man. It's crazy. It gives a leeching of... 20% of the damage done to everyone hitting the target. So into a boss fight, if you are with a red of 10 or 20 people, everyone's gonna get healed by that. So this is very, very good. And if you can, like into the ads phase, as example, you shoot that into the Corvid, like the birds flying around, and the DPS are gonna be able to leech off those ads and survive while doing their combo on it and it's gonna be easier for them to have a clean combo and throw more root and stun and CC. And look, it gives stamina too. The stamina, it's like a immunity during like one second, almost maybe two. So it's a big, big immunity and just the fact that you gain some stamina when hitting the infinite target, it's crazy. Just think about it. With a great sword, when you easy attack, you are losing stamina. But with that, you are losing less stamina for every one of your attacks. So it's great. And if you use a fast weapon like the hatchet or the rapier, you're gonna gain those hit of 15 stamina really, really quick. Let's take the raging torrent as example. It's gonna come back quick. So this is an amazing ability, stamina, we need it, it's good, you're gonna feel the difference if you use your heal use that. And then look, at the end, uh, it heal for 80% of your weapon damage. This is kinda crazy when you think about it, it's not only healing on the leeching, but it's healing at the end. So... This is one of the best healer ability in game. Uh, seriously, I think it's slept on and not using it is a mistake. Uh, you better have vines and use Essence Scripture than have vines and Putrefying Scream in my opinion because uh, your teammates are supposed to have some vine too. They are supposed to have some root. You're not supposed to be the only one rooting the Corvid and Essence Scripture is just better. I know that you're gonna feel safe with the Putrefying Scream because it gives you sort of fortify. You're gonna lose a 10%, but you know, uh, you, you're you gonna lose it when you swap weapon anyway. And um, fortify is not your goal. Your goal is to help everyone. This is... You're, you're doing group content and if you think about the group content aspect this is way better for your group so yeah this is it for this video it's a really really small video i'm gonna do some here and here just some strategic content about stuff that i think that is underrated if there's something that you want to hear about just say it i know that there's a bunch of underrated stuff into the game so yeah i wish everyone a good day peace out